Welcome to Holmes Community College eLearning. Holmes is a part of the Mississippi Virtual Community College, which allows students to take classes listed in our college bulletin, but not offered by Holmes from one of the other 14 community colleges. You will need to have a personal computer with a reliable internet connection to complete your online course. Your instructor will communicate with you using your Holmes email account and messages through Canvas. Success in an online course is often determined by your degree of self-motivation and self-discipline. It is always best to complete the work for your online course early in the week it is assigned. To register for an online class, you will need to click on Enroll Now on the front of the Holmes website. Follow the directions there to complete an application and contact your advisor for a list of suggested classes and an alternate PIN number by email. You will use this alternate PIN number to register for your courses in my homes. You will need a new alternate PIN number each semester. You need to allow up to two working days for your advisor to return your alternate PIN report by email. You may find information about your advisor by clicking on Enroll Now on the front page of the Holmes website or by logging in to My Holmes and clicking on the Academics Career Technical icon. Your advisor's name will be listed at the bottom of the My Academic Profile portlet. After you have received your alternate FIN report, you will log into My Holmes and click on the Academics Career Technical icon. Several how-to guides can be found by clicking on the Need Help in, in the Registration Portlet. The How to Create My Schedule guide can be found by clicking on the Create My Schedule link in the How-to guides. This guide is a handout with step-by-step -step instructions on how to register for any class at Holmes. Once you have reviewed that handout, click on Create Change My Schedule in the Registration Portlet. Select a term and click Submit. Enter your alternate PIN number and click Submit. Click on Class Search. Then click Advanced Search to access the Campus Selection option. In the Advanced Search, you will need to select a subject, for example, English or History. Next, you will enter a course number, for example, 1113 or 1123. Then you will go to Campus and choose Online as the Campus. Click select Section Search. This will show you a list of e-learning courses offered online for that subject. When you find the course you want, put a check in the small box to the left and then click register. When you are done, click on student detail schedule at the bottom right to print your schedule. Your next step is to check your student profile to see the instructor and textbook for your class and to confirm that your registration was processed. This is usually done in 24 hours, but could take up to three business days to process. You may find your student profile in two locations. The Holmes website, eLearning page under Get Started, or by clicking on the eLearning icon in My Homes. To confirm your registration, log into My Homes and click on the eLearning icon. In the eLearning registration portlet, click on Confirm Registration. This will take you to the student profile page. To log in to your student profile, you will need to select the current semester, find Holmes Community College in the list of colleges, enter your home student email address, and enter your home student ID number. Once you have completed this information, click Access Profile. You will want to check out the options for purchasing your textbooks by logging into My Homes, clicking on the eLearning icon, and clicking on eLearning Textbook Guide in the eLearning Registration Portlet. To order your textbooks from a Holmes bookstore, view your textbooks on your student profile. Go to one of the Holmes CC bookstore websites. Click Books and order your textbooks. You may select various forms of payment and choose in-store pickup or have them shipped to your home for $7.50 using FedEx ground shipping, which usually takes about three, three days. If you want to add or drop any classes during the registration period, you will log into My Homes and click on the Academics Career Technical icon. Click Create Change My Schedule in the Registration Portlet. To add a class, you will do a class search like you did earlier. 
To drop a class, you will use the drop down arrow under Action and choose Drop on Web. Then click Submit Changes. This will remove the selected class from your registration page. You will use Canvas by Instructure to do all of the work for your online course. You will find a link to Canvas on the front page of the Holmes website. You will be using your My Holmes username and creating a personal password to access Canvas. To create your password, you need to be in Mozilla Firefox or Google Chrome. Click the Create or Reset Password button on the login page. You will need to enter your Holmes email address in the email box and click Request Password. Right before classes begin, you will receive an email to your Holmes email account from Instructor Canvas with the link to set a new password. You will right click the Create or Reset Password link and choose Open in a new window. You will then get the option to create a unique password for Canvas. You will need to log into Canvas and set your notification preferences to receive information about your course. Canvas allows you to receive notifications by email, text, or Twitter. A student must complete a measurable assignment for every attendance period. You will need to go into your course to complete work. You will need to click on modules inside Canvas to see your course content. Do not simply go by the to-do list. The to-do list is a reminder only. Online students are allowed two absences in a 15-week online class. On the third absence, you are withdrawn from the course. To be reinstated into the course, you will have to provide documentation for your absences. An absence is recorded if you fail to complete any work in your online class during a given week. If you decide you need to withdraw from class before the 75% mark, you will need to log into My Homes and click on the Academics Career Technical icon. Complete the Withdrawal Request form located in the Withdrawal Portlet. All Homes eLearning courses require at least two proctored exams. This is an exam that you have to make an appointment for and go to one of the approved proctoring centers with a picture ID. Holmes Community College and the Mississippi Virtual Community College provide proctoring services through Service Called Smarter Proctoring. Each Holmes eLearning course has a link in the main navigation called Smarter Proctoring to take you to the page to schedule your proctored test. To schedule a proctored exam, click on the Smarter Proctoring link within your Canvas course and follow the instructions on the Smarter Proctoring Student Guide. This guide can be found in the online proctored test information portlet of the eLearning page of My Homes. This guide can also be found by clicking on Proctored Exams under Student Resources on the eLearning page of the Homes website. Any student who fails to take a required proctored test by the 75% mark in the semester will be administratively withdrawn from the course. Student Support Services and Academic Support Services are offered to all Homes Community College students. Information about these services can be found at the bottom of the eLearning page of the Holmes website. This information can also be found by logging into My Holmes, clicking on the eLearning icon, and clicking on the links in the Student Support Services and Academic Support Services portlet. Here is a list of the Student Support Services and Academic Support Services links you will find on the eLearning page of the Holmes website and in My Holmes. Here are some helpful links for you. You can also find each of these links on the Holmes website.